Hello, you are welcome. How to solve this nice uh, problem? From here, we can multiply and divide by the conjugate sort. That is, we rationalize, and this is the square root of. Here we have 16. Then, over here, we have 4 minus 15. Then, we multiply and divide by the conjugate of there. So, here we have multiply by 4 plus root 15. Also, here we have this multiply by 4 plus root 15. Then, from here, when this multiply 16, we open this bracket, then this will give us square root of here. This becomes 16 times 4. There we have 64, then plus 16 root 15. Then here we have this in form of conjugate sort that is power square when we have a plus b. Then times a minus b this can be written as a square minus b square so from here this will give us 4 square minus root 15 then square and what we have now is the left with square root of here we have 64 plus 16 root 15 then over 4 square 4 times 4 that is 16 minus here square we cancel the square root we are left with 15 and 16 minus 15 there that is simply 1 then what we have now is same thing as square root of 64 plus 16 root 15 then here we I write this again such that we have something of the form a square plus b square then plus 2ab and which will give us a plus b all square so let's work this that way then from here we can write 16 here as 2 times 8 so we have square root of here we have 64 plus 2 times 8 then times root 15 and root 15 here let's write it as 5 times 3 and also 8 here can be written as root 8 times root 8 that will give us 8 so therefore here we have root 64 plus 2 times root 8 times root 8 and then times root 5 times 3 from here then let's bring everything together under the same root here then this becomes square root of 64 then plus 2 times here we can bring it up square root of 8 times 8 then times 5 times 3 and here let's group this together as 8 times 5 and also 8 times 3 from here then this gives us square root of here we have 64 plus 2 times root 8 times 5 here we have 40 then plus here 8 times 3 we have 24 Sorry, this is strange. So we have times that's with 40 times to 24. Then from there, we separate 64 as 40 plus 24. That is from here, this becomes square root of 40 plus 24 here. Then plus 2 times here, we separate it as root 40. Then times root 24. Then from here, this 40 here can be written as root 40 square. This 
40 square thinking as 40 also 24 can be written as root 24 square because square we can't square with that 24 that is from here we can now write this as square root of root 40 square plus root 24 square then plus 2 times root 40 times root 24 and when we compare this with this format that we have a square plus b square plus 2ab which is equal to a plus b all square and a a is serving as root 40 and b is serving as root 24 then when we write this now and this can simply be written as root square root of root 40 plus root 24 then all square and from here square we cancel the square roots then we are left with root 40 plus root 24 then when we break this down into simpler sort root 40 same thing as root 8 times 5 then plus also root 24 same thing as root 8 times 3 and also this we separate as root 8 times root 5 then plus also here we have root 8 times root 3 and here root 8 is factor out so we have root 8 out then here we are left with root 5 plus here we are left with root 3 then also root 8 we can separate it as root 4 times 2 then into bracket root 5 plus root 3 and from there root 4 when we separate that as 2 then we have root 2 so that's root 2 then into bracket root 5 plus root 3 then close bracket so here we have the solution to this given problem as a simplified form then what we have here can be simply be written as 2 root 2 into bracket root 5 plus root 3 and that here shall come to the end of the problem so thank you for watching don't forget the steps subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell see you next class and bye for now